Day one. I'm being watched. He may pass me off as some madman, but I know I'm being watched. By something. Obviously inhuman. I'm not going to work today. I I'm... It'll just follow me there. I'm waiting to make some contact with it, to see it. To know I'm not going insane. Maybe I'm just suffering from schizophrenia, and this is all in my head, but I'm not... I'm not taking any chances. At times, I hear a loud ringing in my ear. I just hope that I can fall asleep and this all goes away. Day three. I know it's real. It's watching me. I see it in the corners of my eyes. I can hear it growling. I went to a psychiatrist today. To tell him what I had experienced over the last few days, and he thinks I'm suffering from schizophrenia, but... He's wrong. They're all wrong. I barricaded myself into my home so that I can be alone to study this inhuman entity as much as I please. Hopefully someone will find these letters, find this evil thing, and take it away. I'm calling it the Observer. I'm gonna write exactly what I see and hear. Hopefully it'll just leave me alone. Day four. I caught a glimpse of it today, and it definitely isn't human. It's about, it's about, uh, uh, six foot, six foot three. It's, its posture was perfect. It wore a large cloak that looked black, but I didn't see it long enough. Its hands were large, its fingers were more like knives. It didn't appear to have feet just floating above the ground. I haven't seen its face yet, but I bet it's horrifying. It, it doesn't seem to move that fast, so maybe I can sneak up on it and... and attack it. I'm, I'm gonna do some research and, and try to find anything I can about this. It forever growls. I can't sleep at night in fear that it'll get me. Day five. My research was useless. Nothing is known about the Observer, at least not yet. My house is in complete darkness now. I switched all the lights off, and I carry a flashlight around in better hopes that it'll come out. I've seen glimpses, but still, it keeps its face hidden. Maybe it's for the better. Maybe once I see its face, it goes into a rampage and kills me on sight. Uh, Taking my chances. I have to see its face. But, um... I'm gonna try to sleep tonight. I'm so tired. Day six. I managed to sleep last night to my relief, but when I woke up... I woke up to was terrifying. Whilst I was asleep, the, the observer had left a large cut down my arm and had written a message on the roof above me in my own blood. It says forever watching. The writing was messy but could be clearly understood. It's out to get me. This I now know. I can hear it everywhere, feel it breathing down my neck, although there's, there's nothing there. It's playing tricks with me. It wants to mess with my head before brutally murdering me. It's, it's a nightmare. Something from the depths of hell. I'm, 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 I'm gonna see it. I'm gonna see its face no matter what. It may hold the key to what the thing truly is. Day 7. I 
never seen his face. I fell asleep while writing the last day. When I woke up, it was in the hallway. He had turned the lights on and it was staring at me. It had a large cloak on that was ripped to the bottom of it. Like I said before, it had no feet. It seemed to hover. Its hands were claws, each one to almost two feet long, thick, sharp, like knives. Then, then I saw its face. It had a hood over its head, but its face was clearly visible. Its eyes were just empty sockets, black. They never seemed to end. It had no nose, and then there's the mouth. It was a circle-shaped pitch black. It had no teeth. There was a kind of smoke coming from it. Its skin color was dark gray. It was... It was horrible. My first instinct was to throw my lamp at it, so I did. It, it simply hit the observer and smashed. It didn't even stumble. It's like it... I couldn't feel it. I fled the room with incredible speed. I, I feared for my life. I called the police. They said they were going to be there in an hour. I hope they don't take that long. It could strike at any time. I'm locking myself in my closet. I just... I, I hope... I just... I hope it can't read. It could be anywhere.